I missed breakfast yesterday, so I'm gonna make up for it by having a monster of pancake, two bananas, four eggs, and then I'm just gonna see what else I can throw into it. I actually managed to flip it well. Yay! I wish you guys could taste this. It is so good. Hey guys, so it is Friday and it's a pretty normal day for me today. Yesterday we had our first aid, which was so much fun. Amy's dead too. What have you got to be? Man <laughs> <laughs> down! What else should we do here? So we got a blanket, can we keep it warm? Yeah, we can keep it warm. Okay, so we'll go on my command. Ready, set and roll. So... Oh, was that, was that a command? That. But it is nice to be back to normal because we had to ride the horses like in lunch break and breakfast break and it was just all kind of rushed. So today, David is coming for some training, which is exciting because I love seeing David. And I'm teaching, I'm gonna gym, I'm gonna do all the normal stuff. I've gotta do some work on the laptop. But I have been thinking about something and I wanna to talk to you guys about it later. That's getting serious. What's happened to my eye? I feel like Britney Spears now. Come and get drunk with you. Why? Because they just thought you'd be fun to get drunk with. <laughs> you shut up and ride, and I'll be the cameraman. Ooh. Right, that was a right high and good, lovely. Good, perfect. Good God. Yeah, I can't see when I'm filming, you remember. I'll probably fuck this one up. You know. <laughs> so we went to do my twos today and I asked for some ones and I got them and mum missed it on camera so I got them loads because she kept missing it. So we got like what, how many? Like seven one ones? So Laura and I were just talking about Love Island and I'm the only 24 year old that doesn't watch it. Although I don't watch it, I actually know the characters, which is weird. I think it's because they're everywhere on social media. And I figured out the other night that I met Chris in Cheltenham one night when my friend was dancing like an absolute nutter and he walked up behind her and he couldn't get past her down the stairs. And yeah, that is how I met Chris off Love Island. But I don't even watch Love Island, but yeah. I'm just cleaning a bridle, so I thought I'd entertain myself by telling you a fun story. I'll be the one to tuck you in at night. Does anyone else remember this song? I'm doing a little... So everything is done on the yard for now. Um, and I've just got to wait to see what time David's coming, so I'm just going to go and watch some YouTube videos on how to work this new editing software that I've got because it is a minefield. But it comes with a technical challenge, so let's get started and let me introduce you to a whole new world. A world where anything imaginable is possible. Attention to this blue line here. This is the current time indicator. Is this the song? Yeah, it is. This is a mix, so it'll play... Have you ever heard this, Mum? Yeah. 
got a historic moment going on. Yeah, Mum, someone's died. We need to remember them. Is it him who's died? Mm. Or the yeah. guy singing? Him. Yep. yep. Oh, he's so good. I think it's about to chuck it down, so I'm going to get the ponies in, then get on Wilfred to have my lessons. Do you know where everyone's gone? The movement of the trot so when you're using the stick, you are he's not breaking the... Very, very close. Well, because he's so hot when he's out, he'll do it so naturally. Right, next long side again, you ride with the horse straight and then half past. This is a basic way of doing it when you bend him, but you've grown out of it now. So I've just finished with David and I've realised the time and I'm meant to be teaching Spoonie in like five minutes, not here either. So I've got to get dressed for the gym in like one minute, be out the door and be there. Go, go, go! I don't want to get out. Gross. So that was a really good lesson by absolutely soaking. Um, I'm now going to go to the gym. I'm going to Woody's today to do some weightlifting. Um, so yeah, I'm going to get changed there, get dry there, and then lift some weights. Uh, yeah, that's about it for now. up my training so I'm trying different things I weight lift once a week um, I had then tried boxing I've also tried swimming I've been running and I've also been in halo so it's just trying to figure out what the best thing for me is um, I really want to get my strength and power but I also want to stay supple loose I've got work on the endurance all that sort of thing so it's just finding the best route but this week training wise has felt really good um, I've trained every day but not intensely so last night I like went swimming for half an hour which was really nice didn't like push myself but was really good for the stretching and moving my body around so yeah really positive i am now going to go and get some food from tesco's because i'm starving then i'm gonna go home and i think i'm on late so i'm not sure and then i'm gonna talk to you guys about this thing i need to talk to you about anyway i'm gonna go grab some food would you like my banana holder my boots <laughs> 
so I'm just gonna go and try and do my Facebook live again I meant to do it on Thursday evenings but Facebook had an error so no one could hear what I was saying so it's pretty useless Facebook live so I'm gonna try again tonight hopefully the volumes working this time so the sound isn't working still which is really annoying and I'm kind of hoping that it will get fixed soon because I missed doing my Facebook live last night but this does give me a really good chance to talk to you guys about the thing I was thinking about this morning actually I was thinking about it last night and then I told you guys this morning so you guys know me pretty well now from the vlogging and the blogging and everything that I put out there and you know you know the horses really well you know purple you know the yard you know mum well now but I want to know you guys a little bit more so what I want you to do is post a selfie with you riding or you with your horse and then I want you to tell me a little bit about you and your horse tell me about what you've picked up from following my journey on Facebook Tell us anything inspirational that you feel will help the rest of the Towers Tribe. I want to make this as positive as possible. Spread the positive vibes through the Towers Tribe. So let's do it. Let's see those selfies and I can't wait to know you guys better.